Fascinating that a guy from uh, the UK could take on such a, a distinct, you know, a Jewish type uh, dialect and accent. Like, did you work with a specific coach, or did yeah. they send you down to nursing homes in Miami Beach, <laughs> or what do they do? <laughs> no, I, I, uh, I, I worked with a dialect coach, and um, uh, she was, you know, she was great. And uh, you know, to, to create an accent that wasn't, you know, I didn't want to. Uh, you know, go full Jersey Shore kind of thing, but I did. You know, you have to pay homage to where he's from, and and but also Alan's accent was kind of aspirational, and and you know, it was, uh, you know, it was, um, you know, he, he he was he was slightly more neutral than one would have maybe imagined in his early years. So I, I was sort of an attempt to just find out and find something that felt natural for me. Do you think that there should be like beat poet? Action figures. I mean, like, is that thing something that like the kids these days would, would like buy and like? Oh man, the kids would just love that. Yeah, <laughs> they would like eat it up. They would be like, oh, Corky St. Clair could sell, sell them in his waiting for Guffman store. Yeah, right beside the. It would be a huge hit. <laughs> I don't know why they haven't done that. <laughs>Two very distinct performances on Broadway, Equus in the nude, um, how to succeed in business, a lot of dancing. Yeah. Which is more liberating, or which was more liberating for you on stage of the two, those two parallels? I mean, I, there's there's very few things more fun than doing a musical on stage. Like it's it's like it's the most fun you can have standing up. It's it it is uh, exci like exhilarating, adrenalized. Like yeah, so I would definitely say. And also having come from like I never danced before. I did that show, and like I, I trained for that show, and you know, the sense of achievement at having done something from complete scratch. It, look, it looked amazing. Um, I don't know, maybe, maybe certain like hip hop collectives. I mean, in terms of being wordsmiths and, um, um, and feeding off each other. Um, that's the first thing that comes to mind. Um, uh, gosh. Is, there, is that a term, hip hop collective? Hip hop collective. <laughs> hip -hop like, collectives. Yeah, you know, <laughs> the they performed out of the hip hop co op. Um, yeah, I mean, I think there's, gosh, I don't know specifically. Uh, that's like a really, you know, they were really, what they did was really special. Uh, and I would probably need a little while to think about that before I really wanted to put a group of people in that category.